When we looked in an earlier video how to set up your very first 3D print, we looked at the options available to us in the right hand side of the screen in Cura to change some of the settings. Now at the top we've got the ability to specify the material we're going to be using, in this case PLA, but I've got a drop down there of other materials I can use. And also this very important setting of the nozzle size that we're going to be using, in this case we're using 0.4. But I've got a range of nozzles I can choose from, from 0.25mm, which will produce very fine detail prints, albeit very slowly, right through to a 0.8mm nozzle, which is much more suitable for large-scale 3D printing. So those two options exist at the top. In the earlier video, we used the recommended settings in the print setup area, and that gives me a limited number of things I can change, which is really good if you're just setting out on 3D printing. But once you get used to the way the 3D printer works, you probably want to start playing around with some of the other things that you can adjust in part of your print setup. And the way to do that is to click on the custom menu next to recommended, and that brings up a whole raft of things that you can change. So they're all under different headings, so you can see there's one for quality, one for shell, one for infill, one for material, one for speed, travel, cooling, support, build plate adhesion and then a number of special modes and experimental modes. There's lots and lots of choice in here and there are lots of things that you can change. So once you become familiar with some of the basic parts of 3D printing you can then switch to the custom menu and start using much more uh, control in the way that you set up your 3D prints.